Hello guys, welcome to another video. In this video, we are going to take a look into the chunk method. So basically what the chunk method does is it breaks a collection into smaller multiple sub collections so that you can process them separately. So here in this documentation, uh, there is an example which as you can see, there is uh, uh, seven elements which is from one to seven. Then you chunk that collection with a size of four then it becomes a collection of two smaller sub collections uh, the first one has four elements and the second one has three elements so in practice in a practical scenario one of the best example is given here itself where you are trying to display a list of items uh, as, a, as as many rows for so in a row you want to display three elements so that in each each row there will be three elements at max so what you do you can chunk the collection with a size of three and then you loop over that collection so in each chunk there will be three elements so in each right so in each iteration you get three elements again when the loop continues once it finishes three item loop go, goes back let's see an example and let me open up the editor let's create a collection so i have created a collection with eight elements let's dump this and see how it looks let me start the server so you can see uh, it's a simple collection with only uh, one collection in, inside it with only one array inside it let's chunk it by four then you can see it became a collection of two collections so the, in the first collection you can see there are four items in the second item also four items but the left rest of the uh, collection the last four items exactly uh, let us do another example. Let me pass that variable into the view. Let me create a dummy template by copying the welcome page. Let's keep the styles as it is. Now let's try to print the collection at for each. Now let's print a row with this one. So in in a single chunk there will be four items and we want to display four items each, four items each in a row. And let's pr simply print out that number, whatever number that comes in, uh, comes in the loop, let's print that. So in the first loop we loop over the main collection in the inner loop, inner loop we loop over the exact items in that chunk so i made the uh, each item surrounded with a span so otherwise the divs will come as a block uh, which is as a block element which we don't want and so now you can see that it you know comes in like four elements uh, now you can see that four elements are printed in one row if you inspect the element you can see that there is a there are two rows in the first row there is four there are four items uh, and in the second row there are another four i don't want to st uh, try more css here so guys this is about the chunk method very simple it splits a big array or big uh, a parent collection to a smaller subset so that in each iteration we get a chunk of that item we get a smaller subset of that item so see you in the next video if you are not a subscriber consider subscribing see you in the next video thank you